India has only 2.4% of the world's land area, but it is now home to 75% of the world's tiger population. On the occasion of International Tiger Day, the government of India has released the latest data and it is a big win for Indians, for whom the tiger is the national animal. Between 2018 and 2022, the number of tigers in India increased from 2,967 to 3,682. The tiger population in India grew 6% annually. And this is how it is distributed within the country. Madhya Pradesh houses 785 tigers, the maximum in India. Karnataka follows at 563. And then there is Uttarakhand with 560 tigers, followed by Maharashtra with 444 tigers. The Central Indian and Western Ghats landscapes have contributed 2,526 tigers to the total number. They have now become the most dense tiger regions in the world. While northern states have also shown good progress, many southern states have shown declining trends. In Odisha, Andhra Pradesh, also Telangana, even Bihar, Chhattisgarh, tigers numbers have either declined or have not shown a substantial increase. Meanwhile, Goa says that there are no tigers there. The center, for that matter, says there are five of them. The overall increase in tiger population comes as India completes half a century of successful in-situ wild tiger conservation under Project Tiger. It is one of kind project uh, in terms of both scale and also magnitude. Project Tiger was launched by the central government on the 1st of April in 1973. It is aimed at promoting conservation of the tiger. The program came at a time when India's tiger population was rapidly dwindling. According to reports, there were 40,000 tigers in the country at the time of the independence in 1947 and they were soon reduced to below 2,000 by the year 1970. This happened due to widespread hunting and habitat destruction. Concerns around this intensified in the year 1970. The International Union for Conservation of Nature, in fact, declared the tiger as an endangered species. Two years later, the Indian government launched its own tiger census. The results were alarming. There were only 1,800 tigers left in the country. And to tackle the problem of hunting and poaching, the then Prime Minister Indira Gandhi came up with the Wildlife Protection Act in the year 1972 and a year later, Project Tiger was unveiled. It started at the Jim Corbett National Park in nine tiger reserves of Assam, Bihar, Karnataka, Madhya Pradesh, Maharashtra, Odisha, Rajasthan, Uttar Pradesh and West Bengal. And soon after, the number of tigers in India began to rise and by the 1990s, their population was estimated to be around 3,000. Today, there are 54 tiger reserves across India, spread over 75,000 square kilometers. The tiger population stands strong, and not just in India, but globally as well. The number of tigers increased from 3,890 in the year 2016 to 5,575 in the year 2023. And just like in India, the numbers almost doubled in Nepal. The rise in numbers reflects good health of the tiger habitats, comparatively less poaching activities, also relocation of villagers from core tiger habitats.